Hello everybody and welcome to an update video. So, as you might have guessed, things have happened. And I have not uploaded in what feels like forever. I've not been able to do any of the random game days, which is unfortunate. I unfortunately had a bout with weather. Um, and then my internet went out. Which really sucked. Um, because it was a very simple fix. The power went out, someone accidentally bumped the uh, modem cord. And unplugged it. Except it was in such a spot where nobody could have noticed it was not on, so... I fixed it, thankfully. But anyway. So I didn't have internet, but also the power was out, and I wasn't able to do anything about that. I've been having some really bad storms. And also I've had to change my situation of recording again. It is now back to where it used to be during the Skyborne and Deadly Sin LPs, which is in the living room of the house, which isn't ideal, because everyone has to be in there at some point. And... I basically have to record when someone's working or in another room. To give me some time to record without any sound issues. Um... But that's alright. Because here's what I'm also going to say. I don't have a fan. And unfortunately, when I'm recording in the in the other room, the fan there because I have none, um, it will get extremely hot in there. And usually this is okay, but the last couple of days have been and and the whole week has been in the nineties and a hundreds. The final straw was one day when it was supposed to get up to 115 degrees. And I would try to record the day, I think it was, um, yeah, it was just, uh, Harvest Moon, Tree of Tranquility. I was recording that, I also had a lot of interruptions doing that, but by the time that I was able to record, it was already in the heat of the day and it was 115 degrees. I started feeling a little dizzy. So I had to stop recording, and it's been ridiculously hot since, so I have not been able to record in there, so I had to move my entire setup into a room that actually had a fan. And it was cool. Otherwise, I just it's just too, too unbearable right now for the heat. The summer's been ridiculous, which I hope everybody out there has been safe with the heat. Um, because it's certainly been rampaging my area. Not to mention, I live in an area with 100% humidity. So, the heat kind of gets trapped in and it's always on you. Where if I was living in an area with dry air, um, that wouldn't be as much of a problem. And, yes, I'm not joking, it really does get to 100% humidity. Which is basically underwater. Um, so, yeah. This is the update saying that my schedule is back to normal. Well, sort of back to normal. I'm going to try random game day again. Um, I'm going to be redoing basically everything I've done. Um, I changed the wheel a little bit. I got rid of the games that we already played. I'm going to be playing um, all the games that we already had for that one week. But I think for the two-week episode, I'm unfortunately going to have to change the games that are on there because I want to give all the ch games a fair chance, and if I forgot that there were games on there that I had already beaten, then it's not really giving the other games a fair chance. It's just, you know... It's not being great for the wheel. Um, to be able to spin and do extra time just spinning over things that we already beat, so... I'm gonna redo it, and it's gonna be more fair this time. I also added some more games like Hitman and, uh... Hitman and Assassin's Creed. Um... Which, those will be hilarious for you to watch, because I suck at anything that has to do with stealth. Also, um, since we're gonna be redoing the wheel, I just want everyone to know, I will be doing Bubsy 
Um, I will be doing Twilight Princess. I will be doing, um, you know, Harvest Moon, Tree of Tranquility. Those will be out first. But I will be doing the wheel today to get a week scheduled. Not two weeks, unfortunately. I just can't schedule for that much time now. Because some unpredicted weather stuff started happening and I got, like, one of the hottest days a year at the time and counting for being really hot. And I can't really breathe or do anything else in there right now. So, unfortunately... Recording, having a schedule for two weeks is out of the question right now. So I'm going to have to um, just try to schedule for one. See how that goes. Because um, every time, I swear, like clockwork, every time I record a video, because I think about it for a very, very long period of time of what's going to be in the update video and what I'm going to say and what's going to happen and my schedule and all that. And the schedule I worked out and planned from science, like, did basically scientific charts over um, if it would be okay to do that kind of scheduling or not. And as soon as I pick a schedule that works and that I like, something's been ha like everything usually goes wrong or something happens. It's one or the other. So I hope nothing goes wrong this time. Yoshis aren't too good at dealing with those. But anyway, I hope nothing goes wrong this time and that I'm able to actually do some stuff with the scheduling idea. Because as that stands right now, um, I really can only just do the one, um, like, the one week. That's it. That's all I can do. Unfortunately. Like, I've thought of other possibilities of trying to make it to where that would work for a two-week thing. And I just can't guarantee it. But I can kind of guarantee a week of random games. I'm also going to be recording um, Okami again in the middle of that, if I can. And whenever I can. Also, I forgot to mention in the um, biggest part of this update... Because of the GoFundMe money and all that you guys have given me, which I'm so grateful for, um, that people would consider me enough to actually do something like that for the channel and getting to see the games that they want and all that. I was able to look around, because I did some figuring and the figures weren't good for what I had, the amount of the GoFundMe plus taxes and... Um, other things. If I was to buy a Switch normally new, I would not be able to really get much. It would just be um, Metro Dread, and maybe a controller, and the um, Switch. Well, unfortunately, um, after I had done some thing into tax, and I seen the taxes part of it, because I hadn't actually seen the tax when I made those figures, it would have been $420. So I wouldn't have been able to cover it, so I was like, well, crap. What do I do now? I already made the GoFundMe, and I don't want to change it. Um, so I decided, you know what, I'll do. Since I like finding deals and whatever, and things for, like, less than um the normal going price, because the going price can be really expensive, usually for something like Switch. I um also, please forgive if you hear any sounds that it's like a cage. Um, my sister's dog will not stop. He's a puppy, and he won't stop making racket. Let's cage him, because he just keeps getting in trouble. So, anyway, I managed to get a good one off of eBay, so I do have a Switch. I wanted to do an unboxing video, but I have had some life stuff happen that made me realize that if I did a face cam, it would be kind of awkward. Um, I had uh, somewhat of a stalker at one time, who knows what I look like, 
And I would like to know if anybody in the comments has any ideas how I can do a face cam without really showing my face. Because I don't really know if I can do a face cam after being reminded of that. Um, but anyway. I did get the Switch. I have this stuff going on. Um, I managed to get it off of a guy. It didn't come with any games or anything like that, and it's in pretty good condition. Managed to get it for less than half of what the GoFundMe was worth, because the guy just wanted to get rid of it, and it was in almost new condition. It works very, very well. It just didn't come with any games. It came with the dock. It came with the two side controller thingies and the charger cord, which is great. A lot of them were being charged over that for a switch with just, <laughs> just the switch, no charger cord or dock, which I thought was really stupid. But anyway, um, yeah. So that's what's going been going on. Um. I would like to show everybody off the Switch. I'm not sure how to do that without showing my face because, like I said, that didn't occur to me until Mom was talking about it with me about the guy that was, you know, like that. But, you know, that being said, all in all, um, I thank everybody for watching and supporting me and being able to get the Switch. Um, you know, I will not by the way, play any demos of any games, and the reason why I won't play any demos of the games off-screen is because I want every Let's Play of any game that you guys choose through the GoFundMe to be blind. And that's how we're gonna do things. It's usually blind. Um, unless it's a game I've already played, like a Trials of Mana, which is the only one that I think I've played on the Switch that I didn't play on the Switch. I played on the computer that can be on the Switch, which, if, but yeah, so this is the update video, and hope you guys all enjoyed watching, and I'll see you guys in the next videos, and I'm gonna try to figure out a little bit of the Switch, and also, um, you know, figure some things out about OBS and all that, so, um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you all are enjoying watching the videos I've already made. And hopefully, today, I will be able to record some, some more. See you guys then.